Hey guys, it's Project Lifetime, and today we are talking about the Project Life journal card swap that is hosted by MMDO112800. And I believe her name is Rashida. So, my name, of course, is Mom Scraps, and I am in the groups um, 5, 6, and 7. And I do not have at the moment my journal cards picked out to which group. So whichever groups, five, six, or seven, it's going to be a surprise. So I wanted to share my cards with you guys today. Um, these are the three by four groups. I am also in a four by six group, um, which is group one. But I will share that card with you guys later. So surprise, surprise for groups five, six, and seven. Here are my Project Life journal cards. So we were to make five cards, um, and they all had to be the same. So of course, here are my five cards, and here I use the color orange. Actually, these particular cards, the design, I'm going to totally give credit to the hubby because he picked out the color, he picked out the chevron, and he picked out the little uh, tag, the stamp, and the little cutout here. So this cut here was made with a Martha, no it's not, it's a Fisker's Punch. These are just two hearts from my, cut out from my Cricut. It's like a one inch and a three-fourths of an inch heart, double stacked. These I received, uh, the little tag here, the little mini tags, from a gift from a Project Life swap that I did with Angie B. Angie B43. Hey Angie. Thanks girl. These came in handy. So and the stamp here is a dollar stamp from Michaels. And it as you can see it says because you matter to me. So shout outs to hubby. Oh sorry. The background is a um, Chevron stamp that I got at a um, scrapbook sale. So, all handmade um, by me, and this particular one is picked out by Hubby. So, hope you guys enjoy Hubby's great design. Yeah, he's a scrapbooker. Says he's not, but he is. So, they're all the same. And as I said, I wanted to come as a surprise as to which group gets what. So, my second card is the mustache card. And these are 3 by 4 journaling cards. This is the um, mustache paper. And I used a, this is another dollar stamp that I got from Michaels. It simply says today. And I have this little tiny punch that I use. Believe it or not, from a scrap from a scrap. I use to make these little um, butterflies. So I just put the little butterfly on there. And all of my cards are, I don't know what anybody else's cards are made out of. I did not do the back of my cards. Um, but um, I don't like to be, I don't like where, I don't know. If you don't have anything to match the other side on the back, you know, I'd like to be able to just stick a different card behind it. So if this was my page behind, I don't have to worry about if this was already there. I have to have something to match that. So I left that blank. So I hope that's okay with everybody. So I put this little today stamp there. And I used a like a turquoise ink pad there and a little yellow butterfly. And it's with the mustache paper. I rounded all the corners. I usually, when I'm making my journal cards though, I leave them all square. Because sometimes on my layouts, I like them um, squared. And sometimes I like them rounded edges. So... I went ahead and rounded them for everybody today. So that's that one. And for my next group, I was um, inspired from a um, girl off of YouTube. And I want to say her name is Little Diva. But um, I will put that in the description bar. I didn't want to exactly copy what she had. But what she showed on her channel totally inspired me to make this journal card totally different from hers I think but you know 
nonetheless I love this so this is another dollar stamp from either Michaels or Joann's can't remember which one I've had it forever and it's life unscripted I think it's really Michaels and again I used one of the one inch hearts cut from my Cricut and that same Fisker's um, punch right there and this paper is from Michaels and it's like of a um, crossword puzzle and Angie again thanks Angie <laughs> she gave me this um, oh god this uh, Stampin' Up! punch that I wanted so badly and I find to use it any chance I can get and so I just stapled that right there I love the colors that I chose I am so happy with how all three of my lovely tags turned out and I'm sure that um everyone else I've seen a couple tags and they've been making some really cool ones can't wait to get them all back this is a great swap and I've enjoyed it thank you